the next topic we are going to look at is actually algebra. Before we actually discuss a little bit more algebra, we need to know some basic key ideas or key concept. Let's first have a look at this. 8x squared plus 3xy minus 19. This is actually known as the expression. This is an expression with three terms. 8x squared, one of the terms, 3xy, and 19, minus 19 in fact. x and y are actually the pronumerals. For the term 8x squared, 8 is actually the coefficient of x squared. And look at this term here, minus 19. There's no pronumerals at all, and therefore it is known as the constant term. Now, in any expressions, we got to look for like terms. These are the terms with the same pronumeral parts. For example, 5a and 7a. The same pronumeral part, which is a. 6x and minus 12x. x is the same pronumeral part. And 5t squared and 12t squared. t squared is the same pronumeral part. So, like terms can be added or subtracted together. Say for example, we've got 5a plus 7a. Add it together, is 12a. 12x square y minus 16x square y. Now, x square y in this term is the same as x square y in this term. Therefore, they have the same pronumeral parts and we can subtract them, which gives us minus 4x square y. This one, 4gh square, plus 3h squared g. At the first glance, this is different. But if we rearrange this term, we actually make it into 3gh squared. And now we have two terms with the same pronumeral part. Therefore, we can add it together and it's 7gh squared. Now, when we write multiplication and division for an expression, we don't actually show the symbol multiplication and division. For example, 4 times a times b times 2 times a. We can rewrite that as 4ab. And then 2 times a is 2a. Then we multiply both together. 4 times 2 gives us 8. And ab times a gives us a square b. So therefore, this expression becomes 8a square b. What about division? 12 m square n divided by 4 m n. Rearrange and rewrite it in as a fraction. We can eliminate that and simplify it. 12 divided by 4, that's 3. m square divided by m, that is m only, and n eliminate can be eliminated. Therefore, 12 m square n divided by 4 m n is actually 3m. Alright, this is the basic key idea that I want you to know before we start um, algebra. Thank you for listening.